Hey everyone, Mickey Campbell here, author of Make It Happen and founder of Get Right Personal Training. I would like to thank you for tuning in to this episode of Transformation Talk Tuesday. As you know, the goal of this show is to help anyone looking to transform their body, mind, and spirit achieve success on their journey. And we'll discuss starting the journey, what you should be doing, and overcoming some of the obstacles that will inevitably come up along the way. Today's episode is titled, Don't Lose to Unrealistic Expectations on Your Weight Loss Transformation Journey. Now we all know that there are people that have lost a ridiculous amount of weight in a very, very short period of time. That's true. People have lost literally 20 pounds almost overnight. But there are also people that can do a handstand on a moving skateboard riding down a handrail. Now that doesn't mean necessarily that I should try to, or much less be able to expect myself to just grab a skateboard and go nail it on the first try. I probably want to start by familiarizing myself somewhat with the skateboard. I mean, can I even stand up on the thing? Probably want to figure all that out before I would ever attempt to do a handstand riding down one on a handrail. I might want to make sure that I'm able to at least stand up on it and possibly even ride it on flat ground first. I would definitely want to start with the basics and build some or develop some fundamental skills before ever trying such a trick, right? I wouldn't get frustrated because I can't start out doing some ridiculous Rob Deerdeck style stunt and give up on skateboarding if that was really something that I truly wanted to do and enjoy. You have to ask yourself first, do I really want to do this? I mean, do I really want to lose weight, transform my body, mind, and spirit? If so, if you really want it and you're really ready to make the changes in life that you're searching for, you've got to realize that you are more than likely not going to lose 35 pounds in three days. You have to know that first. The first thing you have to do is to establish a realistic goal and then be willing to develop some fundamentals for weight loss and transformation. Coaching is an invaluable tool for developing fundamentals and perfecting them. The greatest athletes in the history of the world have all relied on coaches to teach and help them develop and then perfect the fundamentals of their chosen sport. Developing fundamentals is only done by repetition. That repetition and willingness to be repetitive in the pursuit of progress takes discipline, and discipline is only developed by building it like a muscle. It takes consistent work and commitment. For instance, if you promise yourself that you're gonna do something as menial as drinking the proper amount of water every day, you have to make that promise and keep that promise daily. You have to be committed to consistently perfecting that fundamental. I know that sounds redundant, but I'm trying to make a point here. The greatest in anything do the same things day in and day out, and that is that they don't break those daily promises. They make sure that they put in the grunt work every day. They don't wait on things to come to them. They make and keep promises to themselves every single day. Diligently being consistent with the fundamentals will get you to your transformation goals quickly. But allowing frustration over not achieving some ridiculous, unrealistic expectation to become an excuse and keep you from working on those daily fundamentals consistently ultimately means that you may need to ask yourself a question. How bad do you want it? So many people give up because it's not happening fast enough. Are you kidding me? How much faster is quitting going to get you there? You're gonna to have to become willing to put in that daily effort, keeping those daily promises consistently, and before you know it, you are going to be at your goal line. Start with a realistic expectation. Know anything worth having is worth working for, and be willing to do the work every day. I'm only encouraging you to do the best that you can. If you've hung around this long, you want it. You are worthy. Believe in yourself. I believe in you. Now let's go make it happen. Until next time, my friend, create a great day. Remember, Yodo, you only die once.
you get a chance to live every breath. Hey y'all, thanks for hanging around. Check out the videos here, and if you haven't already, be sure to hit subscribe. I'd love to hear from you, so don't forget to comment below. Please feel free to share this video with anyone you think that the content may serve. God bless.